The measles are spreading quickly around the country, and doctors worry it could make its way to Arkansas soon. And THP 11's David Lipman shows us the risks posed by this growing outbreak. Yeah, this is a disease that was eliminated officially in 2000, and yet more than 500 people have gotten it during this fast-moving outbreak, something that does not surprise Arkansas's top vaccine expert. When I was in second grade, I had the measles. I can tell you they were the two most miserable weeks of my life. Dr. Jennifer Dillahay says she was fortunate to survive and recover. Many children who had it had lifelong health or mental issues because of the measles. The latest federal report showed 555 people in 20 states got measles in this current outbreak, including in Texas and Missouri. Dillahay said it's not only dangerous, it's highly contagious. If someone is unprotected from the measles, and gets exposed, there's a 90% likelihood that they will develop the measles. Outbreaks have occurred in the past because people pass through the same gate at the airport or pass each other at Disneyland. Adding to fears about its impact here, the Department of Health says the number of parents who opt their kids out of vaccines has risen 25% in the last five years. They underestimate what a serious, terrible disease this is, and so they are um, not as motivated as parents were years ago to make sure their children are up to date with their vaccines. People between the ages of 30 and 62 likely only got one dose as a child, which while still helpful, isn't as effective as the two doses kids get now. We encourage people to protect themselves now uh, so that in the event that they might be exposed to the measles virus and not know it, that they would be protected. The difference in effectiveness between one dose of the MMR vaccine and two is small, but Dillahay said it's still enough she would recommend a second dose for any adult who only got one.